What's with the sudden morning assembly? Oh boy. Oh, excuse me. Oh boy. I bet it's about that girl that jumped the other day. Wow. They don't have to tell us not to commit suicide. There was that weird calling card too, so I guess the teachers are freaking out. We're lucky that morning practice got canceled though. I feel like I'm gonna faint if this takes forever. <sighs> Let's begin this school-wide morning assembly. As you all know, a tragic event took place the other day. Thankfully, we have been informed that she has pulled through. But it will take time until she recovers. Everyone here has a bright future ahead. I implore that you rethink the importance of life and... <laughs> Kamashita? Oh, shit. Mr. Kamashita, what's the... I... Uh... Have been reborn. The fuck? That is why I will confess everything to you all. What? Oh fuck. Huh? Oh fuck! What's wrong with Mr. Komushita? What's this about? Confess? Did the volleyball team do something? I have repeatedly done things that were unbecoming of a teacher. Verbally abusing students, physically abusing my team, and sexually harassing female students. Wow. I am the reason why Shiho Suzui tried to kill herself. Sexual harassment? What? Why would he oh, say that himself? Uh, he is the worst. worst. Really? Physical abuse? I thought of. This school is my own castle. There were even students that I sentenced to expulsion simply because I didn't like them. I will, of course, rescind those. I am truly sorry for putting innocent youths through such horrible acts. I am an arrogant, shallow, and shameful person. No, I'm worse than that. I will take responsibility. I kill myself for it. What? Did he just say that? Would kill himself? Mr. Kamoshida is, uh, not well. Mr. Kamoshida, please died. get off the stage for now. Everyone, return to your classes. I... Don't run, you bastard! Shiho's still alive, even after all the things that made her want to die. You have no right to run from this! You're right. You're absolutely right. I should be punished under the law and atone for my crimes. I did horrible things to Takamaki-san as well. In return for giving Suzui-san a position on the team, I... I tried to force her into having relations. Disgusting. Ugh. For a position on the team? Feels so That's bad horrible. So the rumors son. weren't true. As of today, I will resign from my position as an instructor and turn myself in. Wow. <laughs> Someone please call the police. The police? Is he for real? He's gonna get wow. arrested? Yeah, <laughs> I know, right? This morning's assembly is over. Return to your classes immediately! Isn't this just like what that calling card said? Does this mean the Phantom Thieves thing was for real? Was something done to Kamoshida? Come on, there's no way you could steal someone's heart. But why else would he start saying things like he'll kill himself or turn himself in? Maybe because it almost got leaked? Don't they go easier on you if you turn yourself in? I wonder what happened. Who knows? <laughs> But man, Kamashita turned out to be one sick bastard. Hey, is this for real? He's turning himself in just like that? What's going to happen this to the ball? Do think will show up This now? is gonna be a big... Return to your classrooms at once! Holy shit. That really did change. Yo, that's crazy. Seems like it. But was this really for the best? I... Yeah... I don't 
don't know. 100%. Yeah, it's gotta be. But things are happening way too fast. Huh? What the? Takamaki san, I'm sorry. Huh? We all knew, but we pretended we didn't. Takamaki-san, I had you all wrong. I'm sorry that I spread rumors about you. I didn't know at all. Oh, Kamashita was forcefully pushing himself on you. It must have been so hard for you. I'm sure there's a ton of people who want to apologize to you. We're so sorry. No, it's okay. The same goes for me, too. Besides, that's all in the past now. Hey, you there! Return to class at once! Well, see you later then. I can't apologize enough for what I did to you. I swear I'll make it up to you someday. It's all good. It's a really it fucked like up Kamoshida school. Ain't the only one that had a change of heart. Uh, I mean... It's definitely easier after the fact. Man, I'm glad for you. Looks like those weird rumors are gonna go away. <laughs> nope. My thing doesn't really matter. We made Kamoshida apologize about Shiho. That's more than enough for me. You should hurry and tell her about it then. Yeah. I totally freaked out. I really did have a change of heart. Yup. And we were lucky his mind didn't get messed up either. <laughs> this was an A-plus job. Are we 100% are we sure about that? I don't think he's in the right mind right now. Does this mean that they won't have a mental shutdown even if their palace disappears? I see. So we need to persuade the shadow without killing it, and then send it back to its real self. Oh. Our targets won't undergo a cognitive collapse if we do that. So we can get him to confess with no bad stuff? <laughs> hey, that works for me. Do you have to be so loud? Eh, don't worry about it. So, how'd it go? With Shiho, I mean. She's regained consciousness. Yay! Good news. For real? I mean, apart from the whole Kamashita thing. It was only for a little bit, but I got to talk to her. Aww. I was able to tell her that Kamashita admitted to what he did. Shiho, she... She told me she was sorry. Looks like she found out that I was flirting with Kamoshida for her sake. And here I was, wanting to apologize to her. Kamoshida's at fault for all this. I know. Shiho's mom is thinking of transferring her to another school after she recovers. The whole sexual harassment and attempted suicide, people will label her after that. I mean, that's gonna follow her wherever she goes, so... I mean, the whole labeling thing, it's followed me, so... I'm just saying, it's not gonna really change anything, if it, even if you move. Sounded like Shiho had the same idea, too. Ah, it's gonna get lonely. Yeah. But I think it's for the best. I'm sure it'll be hard if she stays here. Do you guys not know what happened to me when I first came here? Rumors and shit? Uh... She's alive. You can see her anytime. No, well, that's true. I need to change too. That aside, I was surprised you could hold yourself back against Kamoshida's shadow. It wasn't like that. I just wanted Kamoshida to apologize himself. You're so kind, Lady On. No matter how much of a shitbag he was, finishing him off would have left a bad aftertaste, huh? Huh? That's not it. 
I think revenge is better served if I make him repent. Realizing what he's done, he'll grovel for forgiveness the rest of his life. You know? I just believe there are fates worse than death. Holy shit. <laughs> Uh, anyways, that's all settled. <laughs> oh boy. But you know, there was one more thing I was wondering about that castle. Why was Kamoshida the only one who had that metaverse thing? It isn't necessarily limited to him. It's something anyone could have if their heart became warped from their desires. Anyone? Wanna check it out? Not right now. We better lay low for a while. People are still gonna be talking about Kamoshida. Then again, it's totally impossible for someone to find out what we did at his palace. Yeah, about that, weird rumors about you guys are already going around. What? Stuff like you got together and threatened Kamoshida with something close to physical violence. Oh, that? The hell? People aren't going to easily believe that phantom thieves really exist. Calling cards being treated like it was a prank by someone who knew what Kamoshida was doing. Hmm. Makes sense. We're the ones who did it, and I still don't completely believe it myself. Eh. <laughs> Let's wait for things to settle down for the time being. Anyways, let's check how much this metal can be sold for. <laughs> what? It'd be better if we pawned it off ASAP. Ooh, got a hit! What? How much? Wait, 30,000 Oh! That's all a gold medal's worth? That's a lot of money, though. Remember that time in middle school? I lent you some money. Oh shit. There's no way I borrowed 30,000 yen from you. <laughs> Wouldn't it be around that much with compounded interest? Interest? <laughs> interest my ass. I'm not saying that I'm taking all of it. I mean, it's your fault for not paying me back all these years. It's just common sense. Ah, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> I agree on laying low and keeping an eye on the situation. However, you dragged me into this. It would be nonsense not to celebrate a successful mission. I guess we could blow this dirty money on something fun. Food. Steak. Discussions among phantom thieves are to take place over luxurious food. How about it? Hey, wait! Yeah. Ah, uh, I guess it's fine. There's somewhere I want to go then. Where's that? It's a place Shiho and I have been wanting to go for a while. Beef bowl? Space burger? I owe money, so I can't complain. You good with that? Hell yeah. I want ramen. Yeah, I want ramen. We can eat something like that whenever we want. What? Come on, man. I'll leave it to your discretion as well, Lady On. Damn it. I'll call and check the prices later then. God damn it, I want ramen. When should we go? Want to do it soon, like tomorrow? Yeah, tomorrow. Why don't we go on the last day of the holidays? Or that. It'll help energize us when school life starts up again the day after. Then, uh, the fifth, on Children's Day. So, who's going to sell this? Morgana? Leave that to us. We know a store that'll buy anything, don't we? Uh, the, uh... Okay, I'll leave that to you guys. The... I... The, uh... The airsoft shop? Do they even uh, take medals? Back. Is that gold medal real? When did it get inside his palace? I don't think that's it. No, that one is fake. It's just a byproduct of his cognition. The real medal should still be in this position. Yeah, this one's fake. What? You're gonna tell me Kaimashita's had still got the medal? Who cares? What matters is we change his heart. And anyway, if we'd taken the real thing, that'd be stealing. I don't think he'll be proud of that medal anymore regardless. You let go of stuff pretty easy, huh? Wanna forget about my debt? That's different. 500 yen is a lot of money for a middle schooler, you know? Do you even have- stop? What? Do you even still have that dolphin anyway? Dolphin? Stop taking that off! Back in middle school, we went on a field trip to the aquarium. But Ryuji had to spend all his money on the souvenir, so I lent him some for the train fare. I said I was sorry. 
That was for my mom. Well, I guess I can call you the after all we've been through. Thanks. Anyways, we don't gotta worry about selling that metal off if it's fake. End the story. Yes. Kamoshira will never be proud of that once-in-a-lifetime gold medal ever again. Depending on how you look at it, that punishment may even be worse than death for him. <sighs> It'd be nice to have so much time off to start it tomorrow. For me, it just means more customers and even more work. Sorry about that, my voice just went away because my throat hurts. Now listen up. Make sure you close up. Can I talk? The other day I saw on TV... Oh, I didn't mean to distract you. Don't try to stay quiet. What are your thoughts? Seems you were about, uh, able to get a lot from studying <laughs> done. And that, that, that. Get a lot of studying done. All right. Yep. You'll tire yourself out. Okay. Okay. Come on, we're going to pawn that metal today. Hey, can you hear me right? You don't have plans, do you? Come help me out, instead of sleeping your life away. We do owe it to him. Let's have to wait. Hurry down and help him out. <sighs> eh, sorry, I kind of pressured you into doing this. And now to our next topic. Fall from Grace, the story of a dishonored Olympic medalist. Just recently, a high school coach admitted, admitted to a school that he had been perpetually abusing students. Given his prior Olympic achievements, this has quite caused quite a stir. What caused this habitual offender to suddenly confess these heinous crimes to his entire school? Police are hoping that the upcoming interrogations will bring light to this question. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Isn't this friend would come back from practice with bruises all the time. It was scary, but I'm relieved that the abuse is finally going to end now. He would touch me and stuff all the time. I'm glad I don't have to deal with that sexual harassment anymore. There was always these rumors, sure. Not many people believed them anyway. Like, I'm totally shocked they were actually true. At least now I can go to school without worrying. Hey. I knew it. This is your school, isn't it? Seems like it. Jeez. Ugh. Things might be getting turbulent at school, but you need to just keep your head down, alright? More importantly, keep those cans moving. I got some more stuff I need you to do. <laughs> Chief really worked us hard. Peep, peep. You see, it was on the news. No way the school's gonna be able to play dumb after that. I saw it too. Shio's name didn't come up, right? Not that I saw. I bet they wanted to keep that part quiet. I'm so glad. It's finally over then. All we gotta do now is eat some tasty shit and pull all this crap behind us. I'm totally looking forward to this celebration party. I'll try not to let you guys down. Alright, we need to go and sell the gold medal tomorrow. Even if the chief wants your help, make sure you turn him down, okay? 